Each week we celebrate a Western New York woman who is playing a big role in our region's resurgence. As two on your sides, Kelly Dudzik shows us this week's city shaper, someone who decided it was time for her own generation to step up and pay it forward. Lisa Latrovato, founder and president of the 50 Fabulous Women Giving Circle, uh, live in Amherst, New York. Lisa LaTravato started her career working for Congresswoman Louise Slaughter. Then she worked at Children's Hospital. Now she's the Director of Development at Helpman Woodward Medical Research Institute in Buffalo. Along the way, Lisa's met many women who've inspired her. And as the Marines carried that uh, flag down the aisle from at Louise's funeral, it hit me that that generation above me was gone and it was my turn to really fight for the next generation and do a legacy project. What was my legacy going to be? Her motivation also comes from her grandmother, who escaped from the former Yugoslavia as a teenager. Her determination and uh, her understanding that no one can go in this life alone. And without that help, I wouldn't be here today. So it's my, uh, I guess, obligation, uh, as they say, for those who much is given, much is required. Uh, that I pay it forward to others. The 50 Fabulous Women Giving Circle is a group of women from those just starting their careers all the way to retirement age who get together four times a year to network and raise money for nonprofits. They give back to not-for-profits with budgets of less than $750,000 that serve women and children in the eight counties of Western New York. The Western New York Ovarian Cancer Project recently received a grant from the Giving Circle. Being a smaller nonprofit, um, we can take a smaller grant like this and really use it in a way that will benefit so many women. The money will go towards journals for the group's Comfort and Hope tote bags. They go to women newly diagnosed with ovarian cancer. Lisa encourages women to be part of their communities and pay it forward. Find your passion. Don't give it up. Get your idea, make sure you follow it, and just tell everybody you can about it, and it will come to light. This year, Lisa's expanding the giving circle across upstate New York and to Charlotte, North Carolina, Newport, Rhode Island, and Florida. In Buffalo, with this week's City Shaper, Kelly Dudzik, Channel 2 News.